We had been finishing up all along the Watchtower around the world, and we were mixing it in the studio, the final edit. That video had taken a couple of years to put together. And our good friend and producer, Robbie Robertson's son, Sebastian Robertson, had come to visit us in the studio. He watched all along the Watchtower, and he just really loved it. He loved seeing this mod. He hadn't seen him playing for Change stuff in a while. He really loved how fresh they were coming out. And he just said, wow, you know, coming up is the 50th anniversary of The Weight, written by his father, Robbie Robertson, with the band. And maybe we should consider taking that song around the world. I think that the, the, the funnest thing for us is reinventing these songs for a lot of the artists who wrote the songs. The Playing for Change version of The Weight and the combination, this global combination it was like a dream to me. What key is it in, Robbie? It gives it a very special soul to me, seeing music come together like that. I think the, the number one quality for us in everything we ever do is soul and sincerity. Those are the two things that transcend every kind of music. You can't fake that. I can't tune that. You know, I can't edit that for you later. And that's a lot of times why we record outside. Because it opens people back up to connecting with nature and with the environment. And it just brings out a humble nature that I think really supports this style of music that we make with the songs around the world. I pick up my bed when looking for a place to hide. The Weight is an amazing song, especially in the verses. You don't know exactly what you're even singing about or what you're hearing, but they work so well in this, the way the words combine and unfold this narrative. I gotta go. But my friend can stick around Take a load out of baby Take a load for free Take a load out of baby Put the load out of me Go down Miss Moses there's nothing cooler than showing Robbie 50 years after you wrote this thing, the whole world wants to play it, interpret it, feel it, and share it with a whole new audience all over the world. You know, that's what makes music timeless and endless. You know, there's always another person to share the music with, and great songs never end. Take a load off any, take a load for free. The sound of the oud, one of my favorite instruments and everything. When I saw that, I thought, all right. So when you have a song that great, it was a chance for us to, you know, really use the skills that we've learned with Playing for Change, traveling all these years all over the world, and really pull up, put our best foot forward, you know. Go out there and find the best talent that's diverse, that, you know, we have musicians in the video like Marcus King, who's in his early 20s, and Ringo Starr in his late 70s, and everything in between, and multiple languages spoke, making this video. You know, so you really feel like what you're doing is giving this artist a chance to see their work again in a new way. And I think that offers them a, a freshness to it. And it also, you know, pulls a lot of people into music they hadn't heard before. Is it just to follow me? And he caught me in the fall. I will fix your rack if you will take Jack my dog. I said, wait a minute, Chester. No, I'm a peaceful man. He said, that's okay, boy. Won't you see? 
You know, with the wait when we finished the video, I think there was over 20 different artists recorded in 20 different locations around the world. And it's a longer song, so it really gave us a chance to go deeper cinematic and, and artistic. And what I love the most about it is that it, it really keeps unfolding all the way until the very end. You know, that final verse is Sharida and Rosalind they are in Damien Marley's band, and we filmed them in Trenchtown, Jamaica, right in front of Bob Marley's old home. Ooh, to get back to Miss Fanny, you know she's the only one who sent me here with her regard for everyone. Yeah. Take a load off Fanny, take a load for free. I think the thing I'm the most proud of about the wait is how amazing our world is. You know, it just, it blows my mind that there's this much talent and that all of these different cultures from Japan, the Middle East, to Nepal, Africa, and the Congo, all the way to Los Angeles fit so well together. And it just reaffirms that thing we all believe that no matter how many things in life divide us, it's never gonna be as strong as the power of music to bring us together. First of all, thank you so much. Oh.